10 years old. I'm laying in bed. And then suddenly I'm hit with the realization. One day you're gonna die. And I'm overwhelmed with emotion, I start crying. My dad, he comes running in the room to check on me. I tell him what's going on and he consoles me. Fast forward 20 years. I'm looking at these pictures of my dad because his 66th birthday is coming up. And I see how much he's changed. And then bam, just like that, I'm hit with the same feeling. I'm that 10 year old kid again. Except this time the feeling is not for me. It's for him. See, I don't think it matters if you're a 10 year old kid or a 70 year old man. Time connects all of us. That's the moment I realized I want to do something special for him. A tribute. I've always been obsessed with the idea of time. That's why an instrument whose sole purpose is to measure it is so fascinating to me. You know, our cell phones, they can do everything. They last a few years. A watch. I watched this one thing, but it can last a hundred years. You know how I know? I still have the watch my grandfather gave me from when he was a kid. I remember giving my dad the watch I made for him. I remember how happy he was, how special that moment was for both of us. That's the kind of thing I want to pass on to everyone. That's the motivation behind the guard. I've been fortunate enough to work with some of my childhood heroes. And I think I can credit that to our unique designs. I'm constantly testing boundaries through rapid prototyping, uniquely shaped sapphire crystals, engraved cases. It's that uniqueness that's laid the foundation for a guard to become the company it is today. I think people's obsession with legacy is rooted in the idea of beating time. Close your eyes. Fast forward. You see your grandson. He's running toward you smiling. Give him a hug. Now look down at his wrist. He's wearing the watch you gave him. That's a legacy.